YouTube, Poison Dog for a copy. This is Bradley, and I'm here with another video for you guys. You wake up in the morning, and you can't see inside of your tanks because they're foggy from the condensation. You're just impairing your view of the beautiful Bavarian that you made. So you can either just wipe them down every day with a piece of paper towel, or you can invest in some computer fans. So, I got tired of that and I invested in a computer fan. I put it in this tank right here. I'm not actually sure it worked, but if you get a good working fan, you will not have to worry about condensation. You shouldn't let it run all day. You should definitely take the fan out Excuse me. You should definitely turn the fan off. You can either put it inside your tank, but just make sure that you have the blades of the fan covered. The fan can't hurt you, but it may hurt your frog. I'm not 100% sure, but we don't want to run the risk of injuring your frog. So like I said, you can find a way to put the fan inside of your vivarium or you can cut a little vent hole and put the fan on top of the hole. One of my friends, Jonathan Richardson, shout out to John, he actually gave me this nice Google shirt. Put the fan on top of a vent or a hole and covered it with a box. So I asked him why and he said that you don't want outside air blown into your vivarium to dry up your viv. So you want to keep your viv moist. That's the main thing. And uh, having airflow inside of your viv would be pretty cool. In my early days when I used to be at work on Dendro Board all day long, I did read that airflow in your vivarium is good for the plants and the frogs. And that stagnant air isn't too good. So if you have some good airflow in your tank, your frogs and plants will be healthier. Okay, here's a six millimeter fan and it has a USB cable. You can order fans that have uh, some type of other plug that connects to some other part of a computer, but I'm not that uh, savvy in wiring things. I can connect a light fixture or a light switch, but I'm not about to sit here and do that. It might be simple, but I'm just somewhat lazy. But for you guys that aren't, definitely Jimmy rig yourself a fan. I'm not sure that uh, these are strong enough. This is a this is a six millimeter five volt fan. I've seen uh, 12 volt fans while I was looking. So it's either I'm going to get an eight millimeter fan or a 12 volt you know, 12 volt fan because I'm not too sure that this actually worked because I have, I had this one on my 12 by 12 by 18 Exoterra and it did absolutely nothing. So now it's time to try something else. That's what you do when you're in some type of, type of a scientific hobby. I did have a bigger fan. It wasn't a computer fan. It was like more so a personal fan that you connect to your computer at work. I don't know what I did with that thing, but I wish I had it. It was a, uh, it was, it was, it was uh, sort of big, and it cleared up condensation without any problem. So, if you get these, just make sure you have them running on a timer. I read something on Dendro Board, and the guy said that he used the fan for two hours, like two to four hours a day. It uh, kept the conversation clear. So basically, 
the condensation is all of the good humidity fighting back and there are a few ways to find out if you have good humidity condensation is one of them you might see your moss sticking up that's another way in my opinion and uh, I think there was one more so bear with me but those are those are ways that you can tell that you're getting good condensation and you can also stick your hand in there to feel if the air is moist so definitely if you're tired of the condensation on your glass go out and get yourself a computer fan it doesn't have to have a usb cable especially if you're more knowledgeable about wiring things and you're not as lazy as me so with that being said oh yeah one more thing i want to thank you guys i finally hit 500 subscribers and that's really special to me so until next time, like, don't dislike, comment, subscribe, and enjoy your frogs. Thank you.